This is an interesting variant on portable travel lighting. It's made of silver plate, around about 1880 in date. And it's similar to a carriage lamp or a doctor's lamp. Um, the difference being that a carriage lamp would have a square box in this top section with a glass front, which would house the candle. This has a snuffer, which protects the candle during travel. And originally it may have had a metal reflector which sat on the back or possibly even a glass onion bulb. And to use it, you could either stand it on a table like that, or in a carriage, you could hang it on the curtains of a carriage with this claw hook, and then these two spikes at the bottom would prevent the lamp from tipping in, which it would do if it wasn't there and thus uh, getting you into trouble. And it works um, in the same way as a student lamp does or a carriage lamp in that the candle is housed in this column here and it has a spring underneath so that as it burns, it's pushed up against this rim so it won't extend beyond the rim by a spring to the interior. So, and to replace the candle, you simply unscrew the base like this and then the candle sits on the spring in there and is pushed up into position. So let's just put this back on quickly. Now the underside of a base, if you can see there, has got a serrated edge. Um, that's not to provide a grip, but it's a striker for your uh, vestas or your matches. And in here, we have got a little slide out case or drawer where you would keep your matches and then you would strike them on the base here. And in opening that, we can see who the maker is. It was made by uh, Lucas of Piccadilly, a well-established company who offered luxury goods, who started at the end of the 18th century um, and carried on for approximately 100 years until they were bought out by Asprey's in the 1880s. Um, so that allows us to, to date this to round about 1870. So English, Interesting form of travel lighting made by Lucas of Piccadilly, London and uh, made of silver plate.